Hello and welcome to RAFA WA. In 1929, a group of veterans came together to commemorate those who had died, to be comrades for each other and to provide advocacy for other veterans who needed support. Since that time, these wonderful people behind me, the Presidents of the Association, have come together to form this wonderful organisation. My name is John Murray and I'm the CEO of the organisation. In RAFA, we're incredibly proud of our seniors' living business. We provide a sense of community and a continuum of care to people living across our six large retirement living estates, in the community with RAFA Connect, and residential aged care within one of our five warm and welcoming care homes. RAFA have a number of values that we operate by. Here are what some of those values mean to us. R is for respect. RAFA respect the rights of the individual. A is for ability. We wish to ensure people have the support and ability to do what they can. A is for appreciation. Everyone's efforts and resilience are appreciated. F is for family. Family means nobody gets left behind. A is for above and beyond and it's what we strive to achieve. My name is Fabio Pasaka, currently work at Rafa Golden Lodge, I'm the residential coordinator. I started with Rafa uh, around mid-2015. I did my placement as a carer. Straight after I finished my placement, I got offered a job as a carer. The next three months, I got trained to get to know the resident, I got trained to become a medcom. Now, I'm the residential coordinator. Uh, what I do is actually staffing. So I do the day recruitment, their training, their appraisal. So it's sort of like a staff well-being. There was a job opening um, as a residential coordinator. Even though I didn't get, an, I didn't have the uh, qualification, Rafa gave me a shot with a support from the head office and I've been doing the job until now. Rafa Gordon Lodge, to work there is like a family. We are pretty close with the rest our resident. Rafa is such a big organization. I'm pretty sure there will be a job opportunity somewhere. I hope that I'll get another shot to progress. In total, I've worked at RAFA for 30 years, come next year. I was fortunate enough to have undergone a certificate for in human resources, which was funded by the RAF Association. So they saw qualities in me that they felt was worth supporting. My favourite thing about working for RAFA would be the sense of family. You're working with your friends every day and I really do enjoy what I do and providing assistance to the elderly community. My name is Priscilla Krishnavati May. My role is cafe supervisor. I look after all the operation for cafe from the preparing of food and also customer service. The award is for food service in hospitality in HK. I was very surprised when I was nominated as a finalist from WA and we went to Melbourne and that's when the winner was announced. I like working for Rafa because I feel that I was respected in so many ways. Um, I was listened to and I feel valued. And also because of that, it reflected to how we treated all our residents um, and that gave me joy and warmth. My name is Kylie Howard and I'm a client service coordinator. So within RAFA, I do community care. Um, run a team of girls who go out and do personal care, respite, domestic. Often what happens when in community is they don't know what to expect. They've often had no services in place before. So we go and meet them and they're quite anxious it's good to be able to just put them at ease in their own home and say, look, let's keep you here. What is it that we can help you with to keep you at home? After working in, in, big, in big companies or organisations and coming into RAFA, they really still have a very personalised outlook in their care in the community. I'll be coming up to three years in early next year. So, yep, love it. I'm hoping this is going to be my forever job until I get to retire. RAFA has a strong historical connection, but we are always looking to the future. 